Hi, I'm Abby Phillips for the Finance News Network. Don't miss Friday's webinar discussing oil and gas, media technologies, logistic services and magnesium alloys. You can register via the Share Cafe or f and website. Now let's take a look at the stocks of the hour. Tampa and Resources has successfully completed the 25-stage stimulation program at the Amunji 2H well in the 38.75% owned and operated EP98 permit of the Beetaloo Basin. Managing Director and CEO Joel Riddle commented, The team delivered a significant increase in sand into the shale formation when compared to the T2H and T3H wells in the non-operated EP161 permit. Shares are trading 4.76% higher at 22 cents. Hartshead Resources has announced that an agreement has been reached with Shell UK, which sets out key commercial terms to transport and process Hartshead Phase 1 gas production to UK sales point. Shell and Hartshead, as respective operators, will now progress to conclude full-termed binding agreements for the offtake. Shares are trading 7.89% higher at 4.1 cents. Acora Resources has announced that DSO infill drilling results have confirmed significant areas and intercepts of high-grade iron mineralisation. We heard from Managing Director and CEO Paul Bibby regarding the announcement this morning. The drilling was focused on high-grade DSO in the southern zone. We see outstanding results, many uh, intercepts greater than 10 metres at better than 63% iron ore, which we believe is all suitable for DSO. These results will go into a revised uh, mineral resource estimate and those results will be due in the next sort of six weeks or so and that's the start of the next phase of work uh, leading towards uh, the scoping study update at Becky Soper. Shares are trading 17.24% higher at 17 cents.